Did you know that Long Beach has a pocket of these truly unique, beautiful homes? As a matter of fact, these homes are so unique that there were only less than 800 of these homes built right here in Long Beach, designed by the world famous Cliff May. Now these homes incorporated the outdoors with the indoors. And when you're living here in Southern California, Long Beach, why wouldn't you want to do that? Today is December 23rd, 2020, and it is 72 degrees outside. And by the way, happy birthday, Mom. It's my mother's 89th birthday today. So why wouldn't you want to have the best of both worlds, both the inside living on the outside? And that's what these homes were incorporated to do while wow, recreating the early day romantic charm of early day California ranch lights. As people back east had visioned people on the west coast living at that time. Now, these homes I'm talking about are known as Cliff May Ranch House. And what he believed that the modern architecture had lost connection with at that time was with connection with the outdoor to the indoor. Now, in land it was becoming more and more sparse even back in the 1950s because, let's face it, everybody and their brother wanted to move to California. Back then, it was the it was just the dream. Everybody wanted the California weather, the girls, to be a movie star. Beach blanket, cool. That's the name of the day. But everybody wanted to be part of that glamorous life that they were seeing in the movies instead of sitting around at the Arnold's drive thru Now, the younger kids won't get that one. But as a result of this, we had the more house syndrome. So what got left out was backyard living, entertaining, because people wanted to fill up their land with house. So like I said, the backyard entertaining, the backyard living, that took a, quite a big uh, hit there for, for a long time. Now, the California ranch house has everything that a Californian should have in a home. So as a part of his design, well, that comes in no big surprise there. He wanted to incorporate the outdoors with the indoors. So there he put floor to ceiling window. So every room could have that connection with the outdoors. Where there'd normally be a wall there, he would just go ahead and put floor to ceiling glass in, allowing all of that sunlight to brighten up your home and incorporate that outdoors into your home. As a matter of fact, one of his projects in San Diego was advertised as home with a garden in every room. Let's go tour some Cliff May homes. Let's go look at some pictures. Let's go tour the neighborhood and let's check these beautiful homes out right after this. All right, get some business out of the way quick and on to the tour. My name is Steve Arthur and I am a local realtor here in the Long Beach area and all of the surrounding cities, powered by nationwide real estate executives. So if this is our first time meeting here on YouTube, could you do me a solid? And it really helps with my rankings and I'm trying to build that up. And just go ahead and hit that subscribe button that like and ring that bell for future notifications because I do put out videos every single week all about the things that you want to know about and even about Cliff May Ranch Houses. And make sure you stick around because there is a little bit of a kicker to these homes. But his first project, what he did was with the landowner down in San Diego. He built his Cliff May Ranch home donated by the land and they split the profits and well that guy's daughter ended up being Cliff May's wife. I don't know there so it could have been a wedding. But the second home that he was building it was already featured in American Digest, Architectural Digest, California Arts and Architecture, uh, Sunset Magazine, basically all those home related magazines. His home was featured in all of them. So which brought, which brought him to his next project where he did 24 homes in West LA and Riviera Ranch. And he advertised these homes as having recreated the romantic charm of early day California ranch life. Where have I heard that before? While wow, recreating the early day romantic charm of early day California ranch life, but with all of the modern conveniences. As a matter of fact, the very first day that he had heard about the sliding glass door, that went straight into his designs. Remember, he liked the concept to keep the outdoors with the end, and he built floor to ceiling glass walls. So therefore, the sliding glass door was perfect for this home. So 
So what he would do after people buy the house, he would study the way people live in these homes. He would study the way that they entertain, the way they live daily lives, cook their meals, the way they pull into their driveway and walk into what door. He did everything to improve upon the design for his next venture. So he wanted that wide open space from the front door throughout the entire house and for everything just to be at peace with each other in his homes. And with the war looming over the United States, the need for new housing was tremendous. So they took advantage of that and he started designing these homes for defense workers in Glendale, California. And then was later asked by another general to build another track in Ontario, California. And with that, his designs were labeled Reva, wait for it, Lucianary. Always wanted to do that. I don't know why. It was a funny show. And it's day. So when he released his designs, they sold 15,000 like that, making up entire neighborhoods, Long Beach, Anaheim, California. But the really, really cool thing here is, his designs went as far as Switzerland, Ireland, and even Valenzuela. So in 1953, he and his partner started selling ranch home designs to builders and dealers. Well, remember that kicker I told you about? They didn't build these homes. These homes were pre fab Now these designs came complete with pre-cut lumber, the wall panels, the cabinetry, uh, everything you could imagine just to build a home it came with this kit and even of course the 1953 edition building a house for dummy but basically the builder got everything from a to z to build your home now i don't know about you but that's actually kind of cool because his designs were single story either in an l shaped or a u shaped as your family grew and they're easily identified because they have such a low pitched roof line and they have wide overhangs for the eaves. So let's go out and check out some of this. Let's go out and check out this Cliff May neighborhood. Go check out some house and I will take you on a tour of inside of one of the Cliff May ranch homes. Let's go. If you pull into a Cliff May neighborhood, you'll see all the homes are very, very nicely updone. They're remodeled, beautiful homes. Then you're gonna come up to a Cliff Maze property. You can see that they have the fence. So you have your front yard all nice and secure, private to yourself, your low pitched roof line. Beautiful, beautiful home, well done. How you doing today? Your beautiful California ranch, Cliff May home.
you found this video helpful and a little bit uh, entertaining for your needs. Now remember, I am a realtor, so if you are in need or if you know of anybody that is looking to move, relocate to the Long Beach area or move out of state, all you gotta do is give me a call, shoot me a text, send an email, or just register on my website. All my information is down below and I will personally call you. Until next time, you take care. That's all, folks.